Hey confectioners, what's up? I'm Mark and welcome to Epic Confections. This week you wanted it, you asked for it, we're gonna be making a snow globe cake. Let's do it! Before we continue, hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that bell notification for new videos every single week. Just wanted to stop and give all of you guys a quick shout out. You guys make my week every single time I upload a new video. You're commenting, you're loving it, you're sharing it. I can't appreciate it more. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for all the constant love and support. You guys fucking rock. God, I don't know if it's the Christmas season, but I'm getting emotional. <sighs> <laughs> Alright, enough of that bullshit. Let's make some cake! Yo! So to start, I just baked off three 9-inch round cakes, three 7-inch round white cakes, and one 6-inch round white cake. I'm just going to level these out, fill them with red buttercream, stack them up, and we're going to start carving. Let's do it! So I just have a six inch round cake board here. I'm just gonna trim it up about half an inch. So I wanna try to make a triangle shape with this cake. So I'm just placing my cake board right in the center of the cake. And starting from the outside of that cake board, I'm gonna carve down and out, but I don't wanna go past that middle tier. Always make sure to stand back and look at your cake. Just sticking my cake board on the top there to see if it's nice and level. And I think it is. Fingers crossed. It's a guessing game. Cake decorating is all about guessing. Not really, it's actually all about accuracy, but in my kitchen, guessing. So next, I just have some red buttercream in my cheater bag, and I have some really, really hot water in my spatula. What do I always say, kids? Hot water is a cake decorator's best friend. So I'm just holding my spatula flat against the surface of the cake. I'm not moving the spatula, and I'm just turning the turntable as I go and that should really kind of sculpt the buttercream for you. And you're just gonna pull in the top buttercream there. So I am gonna be showing you how to decorate three different snow globes today. This one's gonna be my white, green, and red candy snow globe. So I just have some crushed candy cane here and a few different treats that I picked up from my local bulk store. I'm going to take that crushed candy cane, push it on the bottom of the cake, scraping off any excess right back into the bowl. Just going to cover the entire top with white buttercream. I have these really small, tiny white balls, <laughs> and I'm just going to pour them right on the top so it looks like snow. And just gently with my finger, I'm going to spread it right out to the edge. So I'm just going to start putting all my candy on the top of here. The dollar store at this time has some incredible little finds, so definitely head to the dollar store and pick up some stuff for Christmas. I found this little cute peppermint Christmas tree. It's so cute. Can you see it? So I'm going to put that right in the center. I have these cute little gummy elves. Cuteness. So 
So I also picked up these sugar snowflakes at my local craft store, Michael's. Sponsor, sponsor video. And I'm just gonna gently stick those on. So I just switched to a trim tip. This is a Wilton number 22, I think. Can't read me in my glasses. Cool little piping design. Come on in, I'll show you how to do it. So I did an over loop, an under loop, over, under, over, and under. And it gives you a really cool effect. Next I have my fish bowl, my upside down fish bowl that I got from the dollar store. And you're just going to stick that on the top. There is the awesome snow globe cake. Simple, easy, such a cool cake for a dessert for Christmas dinner or Christmas Eve. But wait, why have one when you can have three?
are the three different variations that you could do. These are so quick and easy. They make amazing centerpieces. Here I have your Winter Wonderland cake. Here is the North Pole cake. And here is the Candy Snow Globe cake. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like what you saw, click the subscribe button and don't forget to hit that bell notification for new videos every single week. Thank you so much to Mariposa Market for sponsoring this video. I will see all of you next week and I have a very special guest.